Hi pals, coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, the Vice Team investigates a foreign police chief suspected of selling bombs and a double murder in the episode Baseballs of Death. On this week in Vice, we'll be taking a look back when this episode of Miami Vice aired, from February 15th to February 21st, 1988, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on February 17th, Colonel William Higgins was kidnapped while serving as Chief Senior Military Observer for the United Nations Truce Organization in Lebanon. Following his abduction, the United Nations adopted Rule 618 and demanded his release. More than a year later, images of Colonel Higgins were broadcast around the world after a videotape was released of his murder by his captors. In April 2003, the Colonel was posthumously granted the Prisoner of War Medal. In music, moving Tiffany aside and replacing the teen sensation at the top of the Hot 100 is Seasons Change from the band Expose. Their fifth single, the song would easily be their biggest hit and would only hold the top spot for one week. From the album Exposure, it was one of four songs from the album to reach the top ten of the Billboard Hot 100. In movies, another week with Good Morning Vietnam at the top, so we go to the archives. Starring Sidney Poitier and Tom Berenger as Shoot to Kill. The adventure crime thriller was a box office success and well-received by critics, and was a triumphant return to the silver screen for Poitier. There were so many great movies behind Good Morning Vietnam, it's easy to forget just how great 1988 was for film. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on Go With The Heat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show go with the heat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at go with the heat. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.